Hi everyone, I thought it would be useful to just go through the Jolly Phonics actions. Each sound that we learn, phonemes, has an action that accompanies it. So I'll go through them for you so that you can help your child with their learning at home. The letter S makes the S sound and we make a snake. The letter A makes the A, A, A sound. We tickle our arms like ants. The letter T makes the t, t, t sound. We pretend we're watching a tennis game. The letter P makes the p, p, p sound. We pretend we're puffing out some candles. The letter I makes the I, I, I sound. We itch our face. The letter N makes the N sound. We pretend we're an aeroplane coming into land. The letter M makes the mmm sound. We rub our tummies. The letter D makes the d, d, d sound. We pretend we're playing our drum. The letter G makes the g, g, g sound. And we move our hand as though it's water gurgling down the drain. The letter O makes the o, o, o sound. And we move our finger up and down, pretending to sw flick a switch on and off. The letter C makes the k, k, k sound. The letter K also makes the k, k, k sound. As they are both the same sound, they have the same action, which is like some castanets. We also have what we call a digraph, so two letters that make one sound, and again it is The letter E makes the E, E, E sound, and we pretend we're cracking some eggs into a pan. The letter U makes the A, uh, A, uh, A uh sound. We pretend we're putting up an umbrella. The letter R makes the R sound. We pretend we're a puppy ripping some rags. The letter H makes the H, H, H sound. We pretend we're breathing on a window. The letter B makes the B, B, B sound. We pretend we're hitting our ball with our bat. B, B, B. The letter F makes a sound, like a deflating um, inflatable. The letter L makes the L sound and we pretend we are licking a lollipop. The letter J makes a J, J, J sound. We pretend we're a jelly. The letter V makes the V sound. We pretend we're driving our van around the village. The letter W makes the W, W, W sound. We pretend we are the wind, so you should be able to feel it on your hand. Wuh, wuh, wuh. The letter X makes the X sound. So we've got the fox here because the sound comes at the end of the word. X, 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 like you're taking an X-ray picture. Q and U always come together. So this is one of the first digraphs that we learn. And we make the qu, qu, qu sound, like a duck quacking. The letter Z makes the zzzz sound. We pretend we're a bumblebee buzzing around. Zzzz. Now we come to the consonant digraphs. So we have ch, 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 like the sound of a steam train. Be very careful with this one that your child doesn't think that the word train starts with the ch sound. It's a common mistake. The next digraph is shh, it kind of explains itself. Then this digraph has two different phonemes that go with it. So the first one is, they, they have the same action, and that's like someone sticking out their tongue. So there's for thumb, but it can also be a harder sound, as in feather. So encourage your child to try both if they come across this in a word. 
The next one is the NG. Mm. You pretend you're a strong man in the um, circus lifting a weight. Mm. Now we move on to the consonant digraph. So this one is A, A, and you cup your ear and pretend to be listening. A, E, you have your hands on top of your head like donkey ears. E, O, so O, we're very surprised. Your hand goes here, O. Now, again, this is um, a digraph which can have two different phonemes. So the first one is oo, and the second one is u. Uh. So oo as in poo, or u uh as in book. So we do this, u, uh, oo, u, uh, oo, as though we're a cuckoo. U, uh, oo, u, uh, oo. And again, it's one that you need to encourage your child to try both and see which one works when they're reading. Now we move on to these next ones. Ah, uh, like you're at the dentist. Ah. Uh, or so the other part we have the e for and um, the double e and this is or so these are this is why we have the donkey ears e or so or or is the your hands down flat on your head now this trigraph is i so we do a salute like i i captain i uh so you pretend your hands are a mixer uh Ow. We poke one thing, one thumb with our finger, pretending it's a needle. Ow, ow, ow. Oi! So you cup your hands around your mouth and you shout, Oi! Ear, quite self-explanatory, just point to your ear. Uh. So the E-R-R -er and the U-R-R -er have the same action because they are the same, um, the same sound. Air. So this trigraph air, we swirl our hand around our head to show the air everywhere. Okay, I hope that those are helpful and please do email me if there's anything else that you need to um, help you with your teaching at home. I've had some really positive feedback so far, so thank you to everybody who's um, watched the videos and done some work with their children um, I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. So well done to everybody and I really, really hope that I see you all very soon. Thanks very much.